Okay, this is the um, November 16th, 2016 meeting of the Dublin Cultural Council. Uh, present, uh, Denise Driscoll, co-chair. Meryl, Meryl Kramer's co-chair, sorry. <laughs> Nancy Roy Treasurer. Rose Volker. Audrey Rizner. John Selby, secretary. Uh, being six out of seven members, we have a quorum. Our um, agenda today consists of a continuation of the review of the applic grant applications for fiscal year 2017 at the Dudley Cultural Council. And we ended um, last week. We had, just to summarize, we had denied two applications. We had approved 12 applications. And by approved, not necessarily the funding, approved the program. And we had five applications that were on hold and had not been decided because of outstanding questions um, and or issues that we had to go back um, to Boston with. So we'll start this morning with the five outstanding applications. Um, okay, the first two I'm going to address together and those were the two one was from Margaret Boussier and it was um, let me just get my notes as to the um, numbering it was 43-10 or 4317 application and that was the painting by Gar Gregory my check. My check. <coughs> the second one was um, an application from Gregory Majek to do a very similar program, a different painting, but a pastel painting session um, within a week of the other one. And one was to be held at the library and one was to be held at the senior center. And we had discussed the fact that there were two very similar programs being held within a very short period of time. And would that really be a benefit um, to our community or not? So I think um, the way we had left it was it would be good to approve one, but perhaps would not be beneficial to have two. And the decision uh, to be made is, is that what we want to do and secondly which one do we prove and which one do we deny <coughs> Denise are both being held at in the evening or one in the afternoon and one in the evening we don't have the time no, oh, just okay. a um, no I'm sorry we do 8 p.m. the one at the library is from 6 to 8 p.m. the one at the senior center doesn't give a time I think but that would be days that would be daylight you typically it would be mm -hmm day programs at the senior center. Oh, wait a minute, no, it says six to eight. Oh, that's, wait a minute, that's the library. Okay, wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. It says six to eight in both places. Yes, I know. Okay. Now, in terms of looking at the ones that we did approve, we approved four programs to be held at the library, and we currently have three programs approved at the senior center. I know, it's that too. Well, the senior center wants $94 more. Uh, no, I believe they're asking the same amount. They're getting the $94 from, from the senior the center. center. Yes, right. that's true. The amount that we're approved, that they're asking of us, is the same. I think we should hold on these because we might be in a position to do both of them if we decide we want to do okay. that. Okay. That's so let's opinion. put that aside. I don't think it's practical, though. What well, what it probably what isn't, but we might have the funds to do it. I doubt it, but okay. well, let's, let's go. Me let's too. move on then. We'll put those aside. Okay. Um, do you want to speak to the ones that you spoke? The two that I Boston? called the state about. Yeah. Well, I'll leave out the um, oh. the, the one from the school because okay. that has now got another whole new flip okay. on it. Um, Mr. Neal, who mixed up the Black Tavern, I think everybody got that email. I sent you out an email that mm -hmm. said the state said, "I'm sorry, Mr. Neal." Um, we got, I guess we got Brimfield. Brimfield was supposed to get the Shakespearean music. We were supposed to get the classical, um, the uh, campaign, campaign music. music. Mm -hmm. 
that everything is wrong because one thing that is good about um, the state doing taking all the applications is she immediately went to her screen picked up the application read it com through completely whereas in the past we would be holding that this way the state had it right in front of them. that was a real plus because she looked at it and said no sorry so we can put that one aside that's um, so that's the deny that's the denying. What number was that? 13. That was 4313. 43 dash 13. 1713. Yes, I was 13. 1772. Yeah. Okay. Um, as far as the feathers for the band are concerned, that was a, uh, according to the state, it's part of a uniform considered in the cultural scope in that the band entertains at football games and they do parades and that kind of thing. So if we want to consider that um, as a cultural entity, we can go ahead and approve it. The state has no feelings either way. They wouldn't, because it's under 500, it's not a capital investment and um, it's up to us. So that one is, uh, goes into the pending file, I guess. And or we can take a vote now. Oh, we can, uh, yeah. Not necessarily, not on money, but, but on as to whether or not we would approve. <coughs> and um, just to refresh everybody, that's the one that James Flynn had asked um, to replace the plumes and the band hats of the marching band at Shepherd Hill. Personally, it doesn't have a venue. It doesn't have a date. And I don't know how we would even know where these bands are playing or what we're going to be performing. If you well, don't read the paper. They perform at they perform games. At the games. Well, they the perform at numerous perform at competitions. And sometimes Shepherd Hill has its own competition. Right. It has, you know, hosts a competition. And, and it's a given that they, Memorial Day, they're in that parade. And then they march in Charlton as well, which of course yeah. doesn't affect us. Um, but. It's the uniforms for the school. Um, they represent the town of Dudley. Um, it's cultural because the kids are learning to learn to play instruments and be part of a group. All that is a learning experience for them. It's a team thing. I think it's a little educational as well as cultural, artsy. I'm, I would, I'm for it, so I bet everybody else has their own opinion. Okay. How much is it? Um, he's, he's asking for 500, and that would give them, I believe, Twenty-five, yeah, twenty-five because they're twenty-five each. plumes. However, however much money he were granted, he would use towards buying X number of plumes, and just replace them as as necessary. So, um, okay, so it sounds like we probably need to take a vote as to whether or not we would approve not money, just the fact that we would fund something towards um, feathers. The plumes and the band hats. One little hitch I was just thinking. Um, we usually expect um, what's the word? display of the banner. Yeah, it, yeah, recognition, I guess is the word, of the council donating something. There must be a spot where he could well, say that. Well, I'm sure, uh, you know, it could be. Maybe if that it he could be done at a game. Somehow. Or it yeah. could be on a program. On, on a program, mm -hmm. yeah. it could be in a newspaper article about the band performing. Yeah, we publish what we grant. We could. We could. That's, that's public record. Uh, we yeah. publish in our paper all the grants that we approve and, and we what could, they're for. Maybe we could ask uh, once or times to. Well, uh, that would be up to him. That's his responsibility. We could ask him to do mm -hmm. that. Right. Yeah. And that's part of the. Approval we make note of it. That's part of the approval. Of we have no, there's nothing that's etched in stone that says they have to do it, and nobody chastises oh, them I if they don't. Oh, oh, I no. thought it was required. No, oh, okay. it's a re request that the oh, okay. council. I thought it was required by us. I don't think it is. No, because no, not every council has a banner. Oh, really? We didn't, mm -hmm. know, we didn't know about the banners until we went to a meeting. Oh, so and I another council history. mentioned that. It's required that the Councils be given recognition that yeah. they have helped right. with, you know, the program or the. But it isn't mandatory. Yes. Well, I yes. think I think it there is has mandatory to be recognition, but yeah. there's nothing that states how that recognition is made. 
whether it be in a newspaper or a program, yeah. Um, yeah. whatever. The council has to be given credit, you yeah. know, for helping in some form. And we decided years ago well, it's very to get a banner in this way here. It's so obvious they don't have to state it, it's there. Mm -hmm. so. Okay, so are we ready? Do we have more discussion or do we want to take a vote on it as to whether it's going to be approved? Okay. I make a motion we add it to our list. Okay. Now for approval. How many are in favor? Five. One, two, three, four, five, five to one. Okay. So it carries and it's approved. And then you you can handle the last one yes, of the question. Um, okay, so this is so denied. <laughs> okay, um, the last one um, that we had on hold was the program three day residency with African Arts and Education Crocodile River Music to be held at Dudley Elementary School. Um, we made an assumption that the person who applied, who um, filled out the grant, put the wrong date. However, um, I actually confirmed with her this morning that the program has already been held. The program, this is the correct date, 2016. It was not intended to be 2017. What number is that? That is, I'm number sorry, two. Rose. Um, oh, number two, okay. Yeah, two. 1578. Um, she apparently was not aware of our local guideline that said it had to be held in 2017 because the state guideline is that it goes from January, July 1st, 2017. They have an 18 month span in order to hold the program. So when looking at that, she was correct in applying. However, based on our local priority which states must be held in the calendar year of 2017. We have to deny it. That's the first time that's ever, ever, ever come up. Mm -hmm. Okay, so she's denied. No, it so came up once before, but I don't think it were on the council. And, we, and it was something with the school. And they called and they asked, how can we deny it? And I said, well, you already had the program. Right. If you don't need our money. If you had it, you didn't need our money, so we're not going to approve it. Yeah. Well, what she explained is that they had to take money out of the activities funds and that they would, if they were given the grant, they would replace that money into their activities fund that they borrowed from. Which they can't do. Which they can't do because, again, of our guideline. And just as it, just continuing on the first, if, if indeed it wasn't incorrect, which Boston said happens all, all, all the time, mm -hmm. it would have been okay for us after we checked with the applicant to change it to 17. That's just so we know. But that's not the case here. Right. <laughs> okay, so we're moving on. Oh, if it does stay, okay. I, I just want to add something. Okay. So I looked at something. the publicity that I had sent to see if there was, if I needed to change it for next oh, year. Okay. And I put the second paragraph, the online application process is being initiated this fall for programs to be held in 2017. By organizations, schools, and individuals. So we're covered. So all that so was we'll clearly publicized. Yes, yeah. they, I was worried that it wasn't. Yeah. And, and it's on our website, so it's unfortunate because it, it really. Well, she was didn't. But they had it anyway. Yes. But she did. had. But so the she kids knew, didn't miss out. She, I don't. She knew of the deadline. Right. She, but it was fairly early because uh, when she did it, because 1578. Right. right. Is it a low number? Well, because she knew the program was coming up. Yeah. But she okay. didn't apparently read that <laughs> closely. So okay. It's too bad. So now we have two that we're holding till the end to see if we have enough money, I guess. Yeah. To cover them. Could, could just but, or whatever. Let do we want to move on now yeah, to the funding? Which two are you holding? The Those two my, my check, the two oh, yes. okay. ones. Okay. Okay. So if we go down the list, first one's on hold, the second one is denied. The third one, we approved. This was Margaret Boussier, 
2078, $400. And in reading through this, um, it sounds like Margaret says that they would probably have to cancel, I believe. So we, how would you adjust the project? The council cannot fund the entire amount you're requesting. We may have to cancel. So I'm not sure if it's that the senior center has no additional funding available. This is they, the traditional. They don't have funding for I don't um, know. They just have to. Okay. Okay. You know. I have they no get idea. Get, the regular budget. They get paid monthly. So she's going to put you in that. It's um, <coughs> traditional American folk music and dance. So are we going car? through now voting on whether we should approve it or not? No, I think we've already done that. I mean, approve oh, it for the funding. We approved right, right, it. Right, the funding. We approved it. We but right. not for the funding. But we just approved the, the application. Right. Right. It's right. just new, a new way for us to do it, but that's how we do it. Well, we'll we'll have have three three. we have one of our approvals certainly open to... No, this is good. Anything so else? Let's move on. Okay. So and they, they request the farm. Yeah, they requested 400 and I don't know what they have a fund there at the senior center. There's a donation of $100. Otherwise, they will cancel. Yeah, that's what that's what Denise just said. So do we want to, I'm going to make a motion that we approve the funding portion of this application for the full $400. Okay. Okay, so um, are we doing this kind of like, let's tentatively go down and see how yes. much money we have. Yes. We may have to go back and readjust. Yes. Right. Okay. So we'll say 400. So we're starting with 400, but not including my check at all. No, right. 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 That part. Yeah, right. Okay. Scott Jameson. This is the one that's being held at the library for the summer reading program. Mm -hmm. um, they did indicate that there could be alternate sources of funding. They're requesting $525. Um, That's 43-4, Yes. This is a reading program that's ongoing and very successful because it includes the this includes this the adult portion of the library and the children's part of the library. Am I correct? I believe this program is just is geared the to the children. Okay. But, but, we but the reading program is for we went to see him we went to it though. It's, it's worth parents and adults. Yeah. Okay. Um, so Nancy, let's sorry. just we'll speak. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I think it's a lot of money for well, him coming to do what he did. You could reduce it because the funds. Yeah. I say approve. Well, kick in you know, additional money. Approve having it, funding it, but not to that extent. Okay. Do you want to? I would it? recommend that we approve three hundred dollars. Okay. Mm -hmm. Everybody That's 43-4. Let's vote on it. Everybody okay with four, $300 for John, Scott Jameson, the summer reading program from the kids at the library? Oh, Three, temporarily. 300. 300 mm -hmm. rather than the 525. Yeah, temporarily. Yeah. yeah. Until we see. Yes. Right. Okay. It's not a final. Okay. Stephen Lewis, we already approved 40. Mm -hmm. Dennis Cormier, $300. He's asking... This is the um, American Revolution program that he does at the school, the American Revolution. Um, okay, uh, Richard is requesting three hundred because the program costs four fifty, but the school will fund. The school is already funding some. Yes. Yeah, but they'll fund it. So I gave him three hundred in the past. Yes. And when you think about what he does, all his efforts involved. It doesn't sound like a lot of money from the from the scope of what yeah, he's written yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. I agree. I, the magician was great, but, yeah, but, that but that's a lot of money. Yeah. Okay. So three. So this is the recommendation. 300. 300. The full three hundred for the, the hands-on history at the is that the middle school? Yes, that's great. For the hands-on history. Okay. The next one we already approved two fifty. Black Tavern, 43-7. 43-8 um, is Kenneth Bukiewicz. And that's for the Black Tavern. 
that's the black tavern. And I thought we approved it. Oh. We did. We approved the application, but not, not the, the money. money. Okay. I cannot vote on that one. Okay. Or the next month. Okay. Um, he's asking 400 and he is said that he could probably, he would get additional funding from donations. We can always adjust that back up if we have extra funding. Okay, Timothy Loftus. We have one, two, three, we already four, five. Okay, Timothy. I'm just counting the, the amount because oh. Na Nancy's not voting. Okay. <coughs> Go ahead. Um, one, we already approved for 43 9 Timothy Loftus. We already approved 125. 43-10 uh, is on hold. Yeah. 43-11, Roger Ticknell at the Senior Center. His um, programs are always very good. Um, oh, that's the Elvis to the Beatles. That's the Elvis to the Beatles, right? And that's at the WC yes. Center. Yes. I think the seniors would like that program. The program is by He's here. requested 450. He's asking 450. It's um, very impressive. Yeah, he does a good job. Yeah. I was, I was so impressed. I rec recommended him. I mentioned him at a music guild meeting and said I think we should contact Music Worcester. He could because they'd like to reach out to younger people. Music Worcester. Yeah. He's got a, so such a variety of programs. So do we want to, <coughs> excuse me, do we want to approve the money portion of $450 for Roger Tinknell to play uh, Beatles, Elvis to the Beatles show mm -hmm. at the Senior Center? Unless I've got the wrong one, isn't it? Uh, this year. Last this year is it, Roger Tinknell. Right last yes. year we gave him 350 But he's requesting 450 yeah, no But the sheet says 485 I no, no, I've I'm got sorry. 50. I'm looking at the wrong one. My mistake. So, okay, so he's requesting 450. He says that if we he doesn't get the full amount, an event of partial funding the event may still occur either with additional financial support from the Dudley Council on Aging, and or a reduced fee being offered by the artist. You want to offer 400? You say 50. You want to offer 300? I'm for funding the whole 450. The guy does a good job, but we can go back and look at it again, or we can just fund it and, and be done with it. We're at 1290 right now for money spent. Okay. Well, if he's that good, he's oh Who's in favor of 450? Yeah. Well, okay. How many? 17. 1740, yeah, because I just. I have 1740 because I just added the 450. Well, you're probably right. I'm not. No, mine's probably wrong. We'll do a. We're not. This isn't the final say. Okay. So, Tinknell is how much? 450. 450. Okay. The next. The Marble Connection. The next two were denied. Yep. Gary Blowski. This is a Black Tavern. This is at the Black Tavern. This is the Great Whiskey Pickers. He's requesting 300. We approved the program, but not we the did. funding. Right. 300. I would that say that's the whole thing. I would recommend going with the 300. Mm -hmm. Any other comments? I'll uh, second the motion for $300 for the whiskey pickers. Well, I think, yeah, we don't have to do that yet because it's not final. These okay. are just recommendations. Okay. Right? okay. The next one is Stephanie Lashwa. This is the art show that we generally fund at the um, we we have have partial fund. <laughs> we partially yeah. fund, obviously. Yeah. Um, and in the past, we've done 500, I believe. Yes. Yeah. yeah, it's on. It's 
Because I think they have an auction and they sell some of those paintings after. And it, it is open to a lot of people. Yeah. It, I, I would say approve it. And we did approve the program. Right. It's just the amount of money. So we looking at 500 tentatively. Yes. Okay, the next one was the chamber music, which we denied. Mm -hmm. um, the next one, James Flynn. These were the feathers, the, the plumes. He's asking 500, but he would take whatever we give him and put it towards building up a supply yeah. of plumes. Why don't we see how much money we got left? Then that we could, the pro, you've, you've approved the program already. Right. It's just to see how much money we've got. Yeah. I, I don't know. Nancy's got a little more. Oh, okay. Okay, so do we want to wait on this or do we want to just get, throw out an amount now and see where we're at? Uh, try for the 500. I, I think we should try for the 500 too. That's my opinion. Okay, let's put it in and see what happens. Uh, so. Julie Stepanek is the ukulele. 65. I'm sorry. 40 okay, we'll redo them after. Because they're, they're conflicting. Um, this is the ukulele program at the library. She's asking. 300. 300. And we approved the program. Yes, we, we did. Yes, we did. We're doing very well financially. I did a quick total there. Okay, 300. Except for the, you know, the painting. That do you want to do the 300? Yes, I would say so. Okay. And the last one is the organic uh, gardening at the library. What is, I, I have a question on this one. Does yeah. he? Will what if we underfund? Will he go with the program? It sounds like 400. That's Let me just say, I'm noticing everywhere you look, at somebody's doing an organic program. Wasn't there a, a, a growing program? Wasn't the Grange just doing one in the last week? I saw an ad somewhere. Um, uh, 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 it might have been his. Oh, I think it was. I'm not sure if it was. Does he say? I mean, he I said he would take less money. I wouldn't know. Yeah, it might have been yeah. Webster. Uh, that's a lot of money. I think that's a lot. I think it's a lot. Just come in. Yeah. Well, it's a PowerPoint. Um, it is being held at the library. He already has There's the potential, potential for additional funding. From the um, Grange. What, if we, what if we were to say 350? Let's try it. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen programs so far that we have funding for. Hang on, Rosie, please. 300. 250. 300. 125. 450. 300. 500. 500. 300. 350. Four one one five. I guess. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> did it right. manually? You got the same thing. Did everybody yeah. the same thing? Oh, five minutes ago. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so <laughs> there was um, it somewhat. So I would leave when. Let's see. So we 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 didn't do anything for the pastels so far. Correct. That leaves us eight hundred and eighty-five dollars, and we still have two programs that we have not made a recommendation on. Correct. One is they're both for the same performer. Right. They're both for the same type of 
multicultural painting, pastels. One is at the library, one is at the senior center. How many programs at the library so far? Three. And four at the senior center. I mean, I'm sorry. Opposite. Opposite. Four at the, four library. At the library, three at the senior center. Then I suggest that we even it off and give my check to the senior center. It's a fine thing. Okay, the if the library was yes. four, then the senior center Which one was at the senior center? Margaret Boussier, the 43-10. I mean, I meant the same. Which one is it? I'm sorry. <laughs> Which? Which one was at the library? The, what type of paper? 43-1. Is that the library? It's the library on your cover sheet. And 43-10 was the senior center. 43-10 was the library. Has my check. Jameson, the juggler, the posters, and the reading. Oh, the $45 million dollar flower. She was looking at the. That's what I was trying to find. The yeah. ukulele and John Root. Mm -hmm. All library. All library, that's five. So there it? we go. Let's One, do it to the senior center. Yeah. Five. That I would get be five at the library. That would be 4310, uh, their number. 4317 4317 and it's for $485. Uh, should we give them $450? Nickel and dime or more? Well, our, our balance is $885. How much will we take? We can fully fund my check oh, at the senior center. Yes. $485. For $485. And we still have, and we we still have, have $400, 400 left. Right. Then the $400 we could give for the plumes. We already gave them the we three. We gave, them, we we gave, we gave them three. All right, so go back and see the ones you didn't no, fully didn't fund and just didn't. add a little more to each one Scott of Scott Jameson, we under underfunded. That's 43.4. Okay, let's go back. We, I think we need to. So wait a second. Are we going to do this to the senior center for the 43.10, or do you want to relook at everything again? Because I don't see any point in that. I think, yeah, I think the, the thing on the table right now is do we deny my check at the library and approve them at the senior center? Uh, yes. 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 Is everybody in agreement? Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, we can offer him something. He won't come for us. No. either one. Okay. Then that's okay. <coughs> so just so is everybody in favor of the senior center for the full four eight five? Yeah. So he's denied him. He's denied at the library. And the reason that we're denying him at the library is that it's because it's too similar a program within a very short period of time. He has to know that. Right. Oh. I mean, this isn't his first year with Romeo. But I don't think, I don't, yeah, he had See, to know he put in that the library was doing it. it. Yeah, th there could have been a communication issue with the two of them as well. He's doing it at the library. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I thought we were talking about the library. He had to know because they scheduled the date for him. Right. right. So he had to know. Yeah. True. Okay. True. So he's out at the library in at the senior center. Yeah. In out, in out. So it's five at each place. Okay. So Which that leaves us $400 yeah. to apply to other ones that we've underfunded. Do we want to look at that? Well, in order, do we want to look at that first one? Um, where's my paper? Um, Scott Jameson, the 43-4. We originally gave him 300 out of the 520. Right. I'm just looking to see how many we've underfunded. Just two. Yeah, because those are the two I checked. There's three that we've underfunded. And those are? The 43-4 Scott Jameson, he asked 525, we approved. We gave him 300. Um, Kenneth Berkevich, um at the tavern, he asked for 400, we gave him three. Um, Julie Stepanek at the no, library, that the okay. ukulele. Oh, no, no I'm sorry. Three. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, my mistake. John Root, 
We he asked for four fifty, and we uh, looked at th giving him three fifty. So another hundred. So how much is that? That brings us to three twenty five, and we still have seventy five dollars. I told you. So can we keep that extra into our admin fund? Yes. How much money? We can take? because we never took a five percent. Right. We never did. No, because we don't need it. No, but we are too sure. <laughs> but if we decide, for example, next year to relook at, or if you decide that for next year, you want to relook at how we handle this, because this is our first w uh, time we're doing this, where everybody gets a copy, so that you have a running copy. And if the say the price goes up from thirteen dollars, which is what Denise paid, to fifteen dollars, yeah, you're going to need that seventy-five bucks. Okay. And then we still have how much, Nancy? Do you remember roughly 140 or something, 143 or something? 64, 13. Okay. Um, right. But then we paid Denise too. Yeah. So, like so that's in the process. She yeah. should be getting her checks. So probably. roughly 150. You know, round it off. Uh, yeah. Wait a minute. If we fully fund everybody, is that what we just said? No. Um, what did we say? We gave. Uh, yeah, we gave him 125. But it, he's that oh, would be 225. If we give him 200, we're even. He, okay. He's short 225. Okay. Is that, and that's all we gave him? We gave him 125? So it gives him 425. That would, yeah, all right. I don't know. If we were to fully fund, we still wouldn't fully fund, we'd, we'd be short $25 on Scott Jameson. So if we were fully fund everybody except for Scott, he would be $25 short. And we have a hundred, and, and actually, should complain. <laughs> and I, yeah, I think that's pretty close. Um, right. I mean, yeah, well, all right. So then don't you then don't put the money in the admin, just right plan. Okay, because we can take more out next yeah. year. So we increase him to the full 525. Let's reduce to 500. 500. 500. 500. Sorry. <coughs> Is everybody in agreement with that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then we come out even, we spent our 5000 And then would Kevin should putting up to the full four? Everybody's at full except for Scott. Jameson, mm -hmm. who's at 2500 Okay. okay. And the school got 500 which is fine. That's what we usually give them. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Can we go down the list so yes. I have a complete copy? Is a yes. Approved, denied, and the amount. Okay. Okay. Greg, uh, uh, 43-1. 43-1 is denied. 43-2 is denied. 43-2 is denied. 43-3 is denied. 43-3 is approved for 400. Okay. 43-4 is approved for 500. Forty three dash five is approved for forty dollars. Forty three dash six is approved for three hundred dollars. Forty three dash seven is approved for two hundred and fifty dollars. Forty three dash eight is approved for three hundred dollars. Oh, I'm sorry, four hundred dollars. Forty three dash nine is approved for one hundred and twenty five dollars. Forty three dash ten is approved for four hundred and eighty five dollars. Forty three dash eleven is approved for four hundred and fifty dollars. Forty three dash twelve is denied. Forty three dash thirteen is denied. 43-14 is approved for $300. 43-15 is approved for $500. 43-16 is approved for, is, I'm sorry, it's denied. For, oh, okay, denied. Uh, that's the Worcester Chamber, right? Yeah. 43-17 is approved for $500. 43-18 is approved for $300. 43-19 is approved for $350. For a total of $5,000. Looking good, guys.
Okay, so the next step is the approval, and, and I'm sorry, the denial letters. Those have to go up first. Yes. Yeah. Um, the last one was approved for 450, the full amount. No, I'm sorry. Did I say 350? No, you said 350. I said 350. I'm sorry. That's a correction. 4319 is approved for 450. I didn't make my changes. Yeah. Thank you. 4319 is 450? 450, yes. 450, yes. Okay, so you and I work on the, Alan and I work on the denial letters. Those have to go out first. They have two weeks to appeal our decision. If they appeal, I believe we have to reconvene. We have to have another meeting. <coughs> so do we want to tentatively set up a meeting in case we need to reconvene? Is it much easier to cancel a meeting than to set one up? I think in all the time we've been on the council, I think we will have one appeal. Or do we want to wait? I remember one. Just I, like I in my tenure of 12 years. Mary, <coughs> I think when Mary was on, she, she had, had we one never had a complaint. Did you get oh, okay. one that complained too? I don't. Okay, I let's just. I think it's for just Mary. Mary. Okay, let's. I don't think we need to. Okay, let's just wait and see what happens. I don't see anybody. Anybody? Uh, well, the only one that could, would question it would be David Neal, and he has no argument because he goofed up. It's a, yeah. Well, we it was a Boston decision. Right. Right. Can we double check the total? Double check the total. You're not coming up. Forty-nine hundred. Okay. Comes out to an eight and five. Everybody else come up with five? I came up with five. Oh, I think maybe I missed one of the maybe one of them that we yeah, did. I think we oh, two. What yeah. are the numbers? The black the forty three eight I think I had it's four hundred. Three hundred instead of four hundred. Okay, yeah. Okay. So yeah. you're all right now? She's awesome. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Okay. Five. Five. Total. five. That's what I got. Five. Exactly five thousand. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't changed that. I think we're all set. Yeah, we are pretty straightforward on the denials. Yeah, yeah. The there's nothing to think right. about is the uh, and what did we have from last year? 150. Probably he should have a separate note. And how much did we? Yeah. We didn't keep it. It says sorry from this. I'm gonna. I think maybe we should take 70 size off. No, it was. I just went to We're just doing the one that is correct. Okay. Actually, the whole office was in. Yeah, the whole this office was in. Uh, we shouldn't be talking. Yeah. All right. So okay. do we want to? We we want unless you hear from us, we're all set. Did you have a question? Rose? Okay. So we got a grant for five thousand. Yeah. We gave out five thousand. Yes. In the treasury, we had a hundred something, hundred eighty. Yeah. You have a bill for the printing. Yeah. So we roughly have in the treasury one hundred fifty that we can use for. Any administrative costs that we have. Okay. okay. Yes. I okay. We, are, we have everything we need. Any other discussion? Questions? Next steps? Mm -hmm. Melanie, take care of the letters. Bill was 1331. I'm sorry, what? 1331. That sounds right. 1531. 1331. 1331. Oh. 1331. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Do I have a motion so, to? So now, yeah, the, the letters are going out. Yeah. They have, what, 15 days to, to two appeal? Two weeks ish. Yeah. If you get any appeals, send us an email. Then you yes. email I will let everybody know. Otherwise, then otherwise we'll send we'll out see you. You could set your June meeting, but I don't even know if you need to do that yet. Yeah. Now, June. Maryland, your term is running out? June. My term is running out. So you will be at the June meeting? I'll be at the June meeting. Because it's July. Excuse me, July 1st. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do we want to look at our calendar and set our June meeting? I think we could. Because you know how it's much stuff easier to set still, it down. Yeah, we're not booking the room or anything. We're just getting a tentative date for all of us so that we know what we're doing. Because we all have stuff. Look, at, I already have stuff falling out of this book. <laughs> Can't okay. believe it. Is anybody away that they oh, are aware of at this point in the month of June? Oh, my God. It's at 3 o'clock today. I do have something else today. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look at June 2017. Yeah, I've got it right here. Okay, is anybody on vacation away? No, not at this point. Not okay. Go and see the townships. I don't remember the date. What? The townships oh, in Boston. Oh, yeah. I don't remember the date. 
you remember if it's early or late? It's in the summertime. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's in June, but I don't know the day. You just make it in. We should do yeah, we'll it early. It. Okay. We should remake. do early in the month, right? Around early the, in the month. Around Good. Because of well, the 10th. No weddings. No okay. Graduations. Um, <laughs> I do have graduations, but that's not. That's not. Week anyway. Yeah. No. Yeah. No we have a wedding, but that's not. Okay. So Wednesday, Thursday, what's a good day? What's a good day? Wednesday, Thursday. Wednesday's good for me. Okay. Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday good for everybody. How about Wednesday, June 8th? How about Wednesday, June 7th? Uh -oh. Wednesday, June 7th? <laughs> 17, not 16. 16. Yeah. Oh, I'm in the wrong year. <laughs> June 7th. Okay, at 10, 9. I like the early one. Does yeah, everybody else like that? Like Okay, so and once we get up at 3, we could yeah. have it at 6 30. We can have it at my house. <laughs> <laughs> okay, June go on pajamas. <laughs> Denise, what's the date? 7. June 7, June June 7, 7 June 17. 7, 2017. At uh, 9 a.m. Mm -hmm. And Marilyn, don't send me a note that says 9 30 because I was really confused. <laughs> I said, I know, I'll come at 9 15. I'll either be early or late. <laughs> one of the other. When I saw the date on the television, I thought, oh my God, I think. Yesterday, <laughs> <laughs> I had to look. It's tough. It gets tougher. I was thinking it was okay. the 15th. Is it <laughs> okay, okay it's time to adjourn. Yeah, at the 9:48, I'll make a motion to adjourn. Second. In favor. Uh, Aye. Aye. Meeting adjourned. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Oh.